With Flipper Zero being a success, a true alternative just reached its funding on Kickstarter, which I think you guys should check it out. The M1, a terrible name by the way when it comes to SEO, was funded successfully on Kickstarter with around 11,000 backers and promised to have most of the same feature of the Flipper Zero. Now upon reading the spec sheet, the microcontroller is more powerful than the Flipper Zero and more secure because it implements the ARM Trust Zone, which is a kernel level firewall like security for accessing parts of the memory. And this means that those data that you have captured can be put into a secured vault. This comes at a price though because both Flipper Zero and the M1 boast a 2100 mAh battery and M1 only promises half of what Flipper Zero's battery life is which is only 14 days. The display use is also different and I think I am more in favor of the white over black background that it uses than the black over orange that the Flipper Zero has. And I would have to note though that in the sample video, I am not sure how bright the screen is because it's very dim on the video and I hope it is not like that in the final product. Lastly, a feature that is missing on M1 is the I button, but in place of that is an onboard Wi-Fi module. Now, it's important to mention that the Kickstarter page didn't mention if the Wi-Fi module would have a monitor mode like the Flipper Zero and if it can be used in hacking and I just hope that it does. Based on the video, they are marketing this as an everyday tool that you can use, which honestly is something that I am having problem with Flipper Zero. And this is coming from someone who changed the alarm of his car to a static one and gave it an RFID engine start just to incorporate Flipper Zero in my daily routine. And the main issue that I have is that the number of clicks I needed on Flipper Zero before I can perform any action. And I hope this is something that M1 can solve like performing actions in just one click. And if it's not obvious, of course I backed this project on Kickstarter and I have received the email last March 8, which means hopefully by around July or August and no. Based on here on the Philippines, I'm pretty much sure I'm gonna receive it around December, but when I receive my copy, I can evaluate it all for you guys to see. And while we wait for that, I hope you can check out my other videos here on Hockeysta TV. Till next time, my fellow Hockeysta.